ILS was approached by a major petrochemical client who was interested in investing into a multi-reactor system for testing catalytic performances of, for different reactions such as hydro-treating reactions, hydro-cracking, platforming reactions. ILS was chosen in that project because we could deliver an innovative solution for such a project and also a cost-effective solution. So when we look at, look at the unique technical features of such a system, we can start from the, the feeding section, where different feeds have to be dosed to the reactor system. And these feeds are quite different. So for example, you can have a low viscosity NAFTA up to a higher viscosity uh, vacuum gas oil. And both need to be dosed quantitatively to the reactor at low flows. For that system, ILS has chosen a novel approach with an online Coriolis flow measurement for very accurately measuring the, the flow ranges. Hydrogen was dosed by thermal mass flow controllers and both added to the reactor. ILS has implemented a novel two-phase back pressure control approach in this unit with which we could immediately after the reactor go down to near atmospheric pressures to then separate gas and liquid products and also remove the hydrogen sulfide from the liquid product. This approach offers some significant advantages as it lowers the probability of olefin recombination and also prevents ammonium bisulfation formation for higher viscosity feeds. We also implemented a dead volume free liquid sampling system um, and also measure the total gas flow rate produced with a gas counter in the end to make it possible to close the mass balance very accurately for our client. Altogether, that provided the client with a very flexible unit approach for dosing, uh, for just executing different chemical reactions and performing different catalysts in that system um, while being cost effective. And we'll also offered a system um, which were using components which are very robust. Because in that unit, the catalysts are tested for deactivation and also uh, at very long experimental durations in the order of several months. So the system must be very robust and just um, keep going even when having a failure. So many bypass constructions were integrated and dual controllers for being able that, uh, to not stop a reaction when something happens. This unit was made at a, as a six parallel multi-reactor hydro-treating unit and it allows the client of testing six catalysts at the same time, at same conditions, but also gives the client the flexibility to test six different catalysts at different conditions. So this unit offers a great flexibility to just compare same type of catalysts, but also test different chemistries at the same time and different feeds at the same time. It also allows the client to even couple two reactors in a row for testing, for example, hydrocracking reactions. This unit was made in, in a pilot size for being able to test up to a couple of hundred grams of catalyst. And, um, also been explosion proof and the overall footprint of the unit was limited but we could make it possible that six of these large systems could be implemented in a small footprint.